um, Rivers United. But uh, looking at um, the other fixtures, um, 3SC continues uh, their unbeaten run so far. Uh, they have had the longest unbeaten run this season. About seven games, um, six draws, six. and uh, one win, which was against El uh, So it's it's pretty. It's looking pretty well. And oh, they still you know they can't stop I scoring. Know, I don't know what you, you know? happily said. They continue yeah. their unbeaten run. I think they've won seven games anyway. Well, <laughs> it's, it's unbeaten. They've they not beaten yet. Um, so and oh, they, uh, for MFM, uh, the boy is just hot. Right now, he scored his 13th goal and yesterday, and it wasn't the penalty this time. Uh, lots of us also scored a free kick um, yesterday. So it, it was a good one for them. The game was already wrapped up at 2-0 before um, the, um, the Barakwa got their consolation of goal. So uh, the Lagos team is doing pretty well, but it's still a long way to go. So it's two more games uh, um, to go at this point, March day 16 uh, now. So uh, the, the league is pretty open because if you look at the log, Imba is in seventh um, spot. Yeah. Uh, they are just eight points adrift of um, MFM at the top of the at the top of the table. So it, it's looking really really tight at, at the moment. Mm -hmm. So but but, but I, I know like I say every time that like this is one of the most interesting league in the world, um, the most difficult league to play anywhere if you consider our pitches and administration yeah. and you know these guys have to travel within three days to yeah, play these games and so it's days. difficult they don't fly they travel by roads and mm -hmm. our roads are not the best so you give it to the players the fatigue and everything and they still give us top quality top. football so it's, it's it's one of the best leagues in the world we put all that into consideration yeah that's the way all, that's, that's all that right yeah, uh, you, you know, guys should stop repeating, <laughs> <laughs> stop repeating that oh, we have one very big league you know what we'll go for a break now, after that, we'll get to listen to Fatah mm -hmm. Shaw talking about Rem, the coach of Remo Stars, how he was able to go to Enugu and get a point from there. As I came here, I've let them realize that if you don't believe, you can never achieve. You've got to draw that picture to achieve it, and uh, it's happening now. First time I want to stabilize, second time I want to challenge for Hormon. If one can get another away win, I mean, comfortable then the second round we can go for it. I believe we are, we are a team in transit okay I came in just like uh, less than two months ago and there's a way I, my team should play and uh, as at this point they, don't, they are not playing that way they are just getting close to it. The Ranger is going through a lot of uh, psychological trauma they, they, they are far better than this but psychologically if you are not there you, you won't be able to play. I believe uh, it's just a difficult uh, period and still have like a second standard to play and uh, I believe it's normal sometimes in football, you must face kind of uh, period, but we'll get right. It's just a difficult uh, period. If time like this, you will be playing as if you're not playing. So I believe with time, we'll get over this. We're not going to any psychological problem. We are okay, like mentally, we are okay. Just normal thing in football. By next game, by God's grace, we'll, we'll bounce back. Yeah, it's not yeah. in football, but it's not normal but, for but, it to be at the bottom after yeah. winning leagues last season. Yeah, but for Remo Stars, um, after a very slow start, um, they've started to pick up our points and the latest coming in Enugu. And that brings us to uh, Coach Imama. <laughs> I mean, three game ultimatum. Mm. We lost the first one, we the second happened. one at home. What's going, what's going to happen next? Uh, it's difficult for him. Um, it's looking pretty difficult for him. I, I think um, if he's not careful, um, I think he's going to get the boot. Um, the, the management of Rangers, they love him as a coach and uh, they love uh, the coach that won them the league after um, 1984. Yeah, uh, so it, it's, it's really, it's looking like a Radary situation right now uh, after winning the league in a historical moment and coming into the new season and, and getting sacked. I, I don't want starts to go for him, mama, but the results are looking pretty, pretty bad okay, at this God. point in time. Uh, a defeat. Um, the, the first at uh, the first ultimatum draw and who knows what will happen in the next. I, I love the way uh, the Remo Stars coach um, puts it. He said Rangers are going through a psychological trauma and it is just in the head right now for Rangers. I, I think they are better than what they are producing at the moment and dropping points at home to Remo Stars, it's really, really, really a bad one. No, not no, no. At all. I mean, Rangers currently um, rock bottom, 20th, 13 points um, from. Uh, sets and games. Um, okay. Now you have some tweets that you can just read. Yeah, I mean, just a reaction. Oh, yeah, papers. I mean, got reactions for you. Um, based on what you said about Nigerian league being one of the best <laughs> in the world, and um, Emeka says basically that the highlights, uh, obviously, seen highlights that we showed, and it says all those games add one thing in common. 
very poor defending and goalkeeping. I mean, do you, uh, do we, you we, see, we see poor defending even from the most organized defenses in the world. Uh, at least uh, we had the Jose Mourinho team, um, Real Madrid, losing four um, goals to zero to one man, Lewandowski scoring out of the four goals after he had told them okay. before the game that they should look out for that particular player. So he's one of the top coaches in the world, one of the best teams in the world, and he conceded four goals. So defending, all teams concede goals. And in the Nigerian League, they also concede goals. But if you look at the results at the weekend, uh, um, yes, Today, yes, yeah. only Fantastic. only only um, MFM scored twice. The rest of the teams were just one 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 zero. It's tough to play in the Nigerian League, and you must be a very very good footballer tough. to play. So okay. maybe maybe that's what you're looking for. We thought we were going to go through for. the results from Nigerian <laughs> Women's Football League also. I mean, three draws and three wins. That was what happened last week. I'm okay. hoping we'll be able to have the time for that. Maybe tomorrow we'll just look at it. Okay, we'll just quickly look at the papers now. Uh, complete sports. Ogu says, I wish Ali and uh, Alaba played for Eagles. Okay. Portuguese airport named after Cristiano Ronaldo. And mm. Yenna just says, I won't bow to Jesus. Okay. You have to play well to be able to retain your shirt. Okay. Uh, sports and uh, life, the last Yeah, uh, uh, yeah sports and life, just before we go. Cannot to receive our coins and button. Um, you know, the Commonwealth Games and Batons going to arrive in Nigeria in April uh, the 1st. And um, outstanding uh, London appearance piece, NFF, that long to meet over <laughs> Eagles cash. Uh, Rivers United suspend Iguma um, uh, Chinase. I mean, Chijo King talked about that. Eagles woo Congo Brazil as well. So it's all about getting ready for the Cameroon double header. Uh, exactly, and it's a good one for um, the Super Eagles to play more friendly games. We saw what they did against Senegal. Now they know what to expect against Cameroon because um, Senegal is a very physical team, Cameroon yeah. also a very physical team. So it's a good one for Nigeria. Congo will also be a very good, good test, test if we get them to play them in a friendly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, if it's going to be Nigeria, I hope no. Okay, no issues. But <laughs> okay, thank you so much for coming on the program. Yeah, you're welcome. Thanks for coming, man. Thank you for watching. I'm Cecilia Amogwe. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm Tayo Salah.